Hello my friends, I'm Dr. Chad Walding and I wanted to get on here today to talk about what collagen does to your body. Uh, we've been getting a ton of questions about collagen. You know, what is it? What is it good for? How do I use it? Um, ever since we released our collagen box set, so if you click on the link, you'll see that we're giving away samples along with a collagen smoothie recipe book with 30 ways you can use collagen in a smoothie. Um, so that's a great way to get started. So first let's talk about what exactly collagen is. So it's the most abundant source of protein in the body. It's essentially the glue that holds your body together and it declines, our natural production of collagen declines as we age. Now our ancestors um, got collagen because they ate nose to tail with the animal. They ate all parts of the animal and they would often take the bones of the animal and put that in a pot and boil it for you know eight to twelve hours and make a broth and they would use this broth um, in their soups they would drink it straight and that's a way that they would get plenty of collagen in their diet but for most of us in our modern diets you know not only are we eating way too much sugar and way too many toxic fats and gut irritating foods but we're not getting near enough collagen and it's causing us to, to age quicker. It's also causing us to have brittle nails and uh, skin that wrinkles and even teeth that breaks down. So let's talk about what it's good for. Oh, hi, Sylvia, how are you doing? I love it when you get guys say hi. It's awesome how uh, we can interact in that way. So first of all, I want you guys to know that collagen is, is good for so many reasons. And one of the main things that it does is it protects your brain, uh, specifically from things like memory loss and Alzheimer's. And what they found with certain studies is that collagen attacks certain proteins that uh, cause Alzheimer's. So it pr performs this protective layer around your brain. And that's one of the things I notice too, when I start taking collagen on a consistent basis, I'm just on. It seems like I'm more engaged, more interactive. Hello, Adeline, nice to see you. So definitely think of it as something that's good for your brain. And this really makes sense because the brain is mostly um, fatty tissue and that and when you form that protective layer around there you'll see a lot of benefits second thing collagen does is it gonna it's gonna help lower your cholesterol and your risk for heart disease they actually did a study where they gave participants uh, two servings of collagen every day for six months and they found that what it did is it lowered their cholesterol ratio so you, you might remember that the higher your cholesterol ratio is the, the higher your risk for heart disease is so they found it actually lowered it um, but the other thing they found is it removes a lot of the plaque in the arteries that cause that buildup and increase your risk for heart disease. So it's a huge benefit. Think about, you know, it improves the brain, it improves your, your risk for heart disease. Those are huge, two huge things right there. Um, the other thing it does is it helps heal a leaky gut. Now, this is one of the main things we talk about a lot in our 30 day challenge, the importance of gut health. Your, your gut is essentially where 80% of your immune system lies. It's where you break down your food. It's where you remove toxins. A lot of the neurotransmitters like serotonin and dopamine, and they're all produced in the gut, the things that make you happy. Um, but many of us have problems with a, a leaky gut because we've been eating a lot of foods that poke holes in our intestinal lining, and this allows foreign proteins to get into our bloodstream, and it sets off an immune response. So one of the things we, we talk about in our 30-day challenge is stop eating gut-irritating foods. And then you want to seal the gut lining because the gut lining is made up of collagen. So you essentially make that barrier much stronger. And uh, when you start consuming collagen on a consistent basis and your immune system gets better, you eliminate toxins better, your mood improves, all those things simply because you improve the health of your gut. I really want you guys to know um, that when you improve the gut, everything else just naturally gets better. Hello, Joni. Hello, Mary. I love it when you guys engage. So awesome. So. Three things we've talked about so far. Collagen helps improve your brain, helps improve uh, your, your heart, you know, lowers your risk for heart disease, and improves your gut. Next thing it does is it, it lowers your, your joint pain. I'm a physical therapist, so I, I was constantly working with people who have dealing with shoulder pain, knee pain, back pain, neck pain. You know, there's two essential things going on here. You know, poor positions, uh, poor movement patterns, but also you know, poor uh, nutrition, you know? so uh, lots of inflammation. Now I mentioned earlier that collagen is essentially the glue that holds your body together and it's because collagen makes up the, the joint capsules, right? The tendons, the ligaments, all those things that keep your joints nice and stable. So when you're consuming more collagen, every, bit, every single little joint in your body is going to get stronger, right? You're going to reduce your, your risk for falls because your mobility is improving. You're, you're going to actually... Um, 
walk better, sit, sit and stand better, all those things. Another thing I want to mention, it's incredibly important that you have good mobility, right? Your ability to get down on the ground and up is extremely important as you age. I worked with a lot of people um, and once your risk for falls go up and you have a fall, you could likely have a hip fracture, you know, so that increases your risk for, um, for early mortality. So improve your mobility, ease your joint pain. Collagen is a simple thing you can do on a consistent basis to help that. Hello, Marilyn. Oh gosh, love you guys too. Thank you so much for watching. Um, and another thing uh, that we get a lot of is people tell us that their, their skin elasticity improves. So like wrinkles, um, cellulite, some of the common pl complaints that many people have. Um, you know, your, your skin also is just a, a, another form of collagen, right? So many of us have wrinkles in early aging because we're not getting enough. We have so many people who have taken collagen on a consistent basis now. We, we released this earlier this year. We've sold around 50,000 bottles of this. And now we've gotten a lot of feedback, you know, a lot of testimonials from people telling us their experience. And one of the main things they're telling us is that their skin is improving, their wrinkles are going away. And if you click on that link that I, I'm posting here where you can learn more about the collagen box set, you'll see testimonials and videos of people at the bottom who are always consistently talking about improvements with their, with their skin. And the other thing they're saying is their teeth is improving and their nails are getting stronger. And again, these are things that are just made up of collagen. So those are some big things we talked about, improving your brain health, improving your heart health, uh, improving your gut health, right? Um, improving your joint pain, your mobility, your, your skin elasticity, and stronger teeth, skin, and, and nails, right? So pretty much so many, so many things in your body gets better. So it's really important that you start consuming collagen and start consuming it on a consistent basis if you, if you wanna see improvements uh, in any of those areas. Now our ancestors, like I mentioned, they, they got it because they ate nose to tail. They would also make a lot of bone broth and those are, those are things you can do. Eating nose to tail is not something that's appealing to most people nowadays. Um, bone broth is something that my wife and I do uh, maybe once every two weeks, but it does take a lot of time. It's hard to find good quality bones and it's sort of kind of stinks up the house with that brothy smell. So we do that uh, just only time to time. But one of the other ways we get it is through the foods that we eat. So good foods that you can eat that have good sources of collagen would be cod, tuna, eggs, avocados. Those are great sources of collagen. Leafy greens such as kale and spinach are also things you want to eat on a consistent basis. Berries, garlic, chia seeds, pumpkin seeds, those are all super foods for improving your intake of collagen. Um, but one of the things that we recommend people do every day is just start consuming a good quality source of uh, collagen in supplemental form. So this is ours, Native Path Collagen. And again, we're, we're giving away sample offers. Um, we, we took this, broke it down into a sample serving size, and included with that offer, we are, are having 30 smoothie recipes go along with it because a lot of people wonder, how the heck do I use it? So I actually put it in my coffee um, every day. I put a little bit of butter, a little bit of coconut oil in there. I blend it up and it's really nice. And the cool thing about collagen is it's tasteless and it's odorless, right? So here's the scoop right here. And you can see it's really fine. It's just a powder, right? really easy so you can put it in lots of things uh, you could also put it in your teas you can mix it in hot liquids cold liquids um, you can put it in soups you can sprinkle it over your food those are all great ways to, to use it um, but like i said we're going to make it super easy for you and give you uh, 30 smoothie collagen recipes so um, you can start your day out right and that's another thing i want to really encourage all of you is when you start your day out with with a better source of coffee or a smoothie with, with uh, you know, not, not lots of sugar, but good quality proteins, you make it easier for you to make good decisions for the rest of your day, right? So hi, Joni. Oh, yes, and heal the gut lining, yes, for sure. So um, it's really important. Like it's one of the biggest things we talk about in a 30-day challenge. Start your day with good food and, and less sugar and good quality proteins and good quality fats, and your blood sugar stabilizes, and it's sort of the one thing that makes everything else much easier. Now, I do want to mention when it comes to collagen, you want to make sure that the source is good quality. There's so many brands out there now because collagen is such a hot topic. Um, but unfortunately, many of these brands are compromising the quality of that collagen. So um, there's lots of collagen being sourced from places like China and from cows that are in, 
you know, feedlots where they're giving these cows grains and hormones and antibiotics. And what happens is if you're getting your collagen from those type of places, it negatively impacts the quality of that collagen. So you're not just what you eat, you are what you eat eats. It's really important. So what you're looking for is grass-fed collagen, you know, free of any hormones and antibiotics. You know, the nice thing about ours is it's from cows roaming on green pastures in Brazil. They're super happy cows. Our collagen doesn't have any artificial flavors or any sugar or anything like that. And that's another thing that uh, a lot of a lot of people are are uh, appreciating in that way. So um, Betty says what to do uh, for heartburn. Well, collagen definitely improves the health of your heart. But another thing I would recommend um, with heartburn um, is to lower your refined carbohydrates, making sure you're not eating a lot of refined carbohydrates. And one of the great things that you can do is start consuming the uh, smoothies that we're recommending with this collagen. You can click on that link, see our collagen box set, but those smoothies in there have, you know, they're very low on the glycemic index and uh, with this good quality collagen and the, f the good quality fats that we ask you to put in there, uh, you're definitely going to improve uh, your, your feelings around that heartburn. Other, also, make sure you chew your food and not uh, drink uh, water or anything, any liquids with your food while you eat it. So those are some simple things you can do. But and we do have around, I think, 200 more of the sample bottles that we can um, give away because so many people are asking for it. So what I recommend, go ahead and click on that. Um, this is a good way for you to start trying collagen on a consistent basis. Um, I also recommend to begin with, you know, because we offer 20 gram servings per scoop. That's actually more than the other brands out there, they're only offering 10 gram servings. But to start out, I would say ramp up slowly. Just use about half a scoop consistently every day. That'll get you 10 days. You can start trying this, the collagen out and uh, put it in your smoothies. Start, start noticing what happens there um, and you'll start seeing the benefits. So click on that link, get your sample and uh, start using those smoothies on a consistent basis. And if you guys have any questions, um, leave them in the comments area here. I'll be around all day. I'm happy to answer any questions you may have about this. And if you enjoy this video, we appreciate a like, a comment, a share, let your friends know about it. And uh, you know, step by step, we'll, we'll get each other healthy and we'll, we'll go ahead and change this thing around. So hope you guys enjoyed that. Have a wonderful day. I will talk to you soon. Bye-bye.